Hello ladies and gents, Ro here, and welcome to Normal Films. Today I am starting my brand new tutorial series on Final Cut Pro 10.2. Um, I say 10.2 because there's a new update that was just released not that long ago for Final Cut, and I thought it would be nice to start fresh with a new update for the actual program. Final Cut Pro is going to be a huge upgrade for you guys if you've seen my iMovie tutorials, and if you're trying to look for a better program, I suggest, highly recommend Final Cut Pro. It can be a little bit expensive, but trust me it is well worth it here I have on the screen is uh, some of the updates they included some of the main important changes they've included for Final Cut Pro within its update the 10.2 so let me go ahead and jump right in and show you guys the basic overview of the application and uh, where you can get it yourself so if you go up and launch your app store and you go ahead to your search bar at the top right hand corner and search Final Cut Pro it should be one of the suggestions and should pop up right here to top left hand corner and here you have it it's uh, $299.99 but is I can guarantee you guys it's well worth it and within my tutorials if you watch it with me you're gonna definitely learn a lot um, you got the additional features here they added uh, that are listed here below within the 10.2 update um, the application itself is about three gigabytes in size and uh, it should run on your computer as long as you don't have a uh, it says actually right here compatibility OS 10 10.2 10 10 or later 64 bit processor. So the way you can check and see, make sure you're uh, you can run this. Go to your Apple logo at the top left hand corner. Go to about this Mac, and it'll give you some of the information regarding your Mac. And make sure your OS is 10.10.2 10 or later, as it says here. Um, here's the overall just the images. You can go ahead and browse around it. Maybe even look through the reviews and see it for yourself. But uh, also, if you can't find it in the App Store, you can also go ahead and go online and search within the Apple, apple.com. You can go ahead and search, and you'll be able to find Final Cut Pro online as well, and you'll be able to purchase it from there as well. And all the same standard compatibility and size all apply the same way online. But that's the basics overview of this application. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys next tutorial, and later. So let my